Okay. We've got, got the Sherman ready for paint. Let's get the Tiger done. And we'll get this baby all assembled up and see what we come up with. All right, so hold tight. Let me get organized and we're going to get right to work.
And there it is. There is the tiger. So, here is my plan. We're going to do these up like uh, near the end of the battle in uh, Fury. So, we're going to have the Fury, the Fury tank trying to get around to the back end of the tiger who's swiveling his cannon to get back at him. The plan is, though, we're going to cartoon this up a bit. So, I'm actually going to have the Fury up on, two, up on its tracks trying to get around behind. I'll have the tiger, you know, this way. We'll just try and get it all kind of funned out. So that's the plan. And then I'm going to uh, detail up both of these so that they match the vehicles in the movie. So, you know, we'll have, instead of Fury, we'll probably play, you know, Grumpy on the side and the markings and the numbers. Same way with this, I'm going to paint on the back where he gets shot nine. So, you know, that sort of thing. It's just going to be kind of a fun rendition of that scene. And uh, that's where we're at today. So these things went together really simple. Uh, we're talking, you know, a basic, maybe hour-long build if you're really getting froggy. Uh, most of it is all push fit and snap fit. I did use glue just because I'm going to be doing a lot of painting and all that sort of stuff. So they're nice little kits, very little flash. Um, they clean up very easy. So yeah, and the instructions are fairly clear. There's not much to um, watch for. So yeah, the difficult thing with the uh, Tiger though is they have the uh, interlaced uh, road wheels so when you're putting them on you need to make sure that you have them kind of lined up and put together first then push them all onto the uh, chassis in one go so you're gonna kind of align all the holes and then just push them all together so but there we go so Hold tight for uh, the next video in a little bit. Uh, well, like I said, as soon as the paint is dry on the Martian War Machine, we'll be getting back on that. And uh, we'll be doing this in between. And once the machine is done, we'll uh, go full time on this one. So, as always, I hope you're having a great day. I hope you're uh, staying safe. And uh, till next time, you know, keep on modeling. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. Thanks a lot and have a great day.